And if anybody else jumps in, don't worry, you'll see me run toward the TV and I'll just let them in and you'll keep going. I can't jump around a lot today. I had an appointment yesterday, so I can't um, go too heavy. So if it looks like I'm not jumping around a lot or like keeping up today, that's why. But don't worry, I am going to keep everybody else moving. So don't mind me. All right, away we go. All right, so we're gonna start off right here. We're gonna get this core warmed up first. All right, so we're gonna come to the front of our mat, arms up, and we're gonna go forward roll, halfway down and then up, okay? Up and squeeze. So we're just gonna bend halfway over and we're gonna stand up and we're gonna squeeze. Good. We're just gonna get the hips moving. Just stop right at your hip level, come up and squeeze. And then we're gonna go all the way down. And then we're gonna come all the way up, slow and controlled. Down and up, drawing in the belly button, going down and up. All right, keep going. We got about 15 seconds right here. Go down, breathing. And we're gonna turn this into a slow squat in three, two, and right here. So slow squat down, stand up, push the hips forward. And Jody, I think we matched today. We're so well coordinated. I know, right? <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, 15 seconds right here. Coming down, stand up and squeeze. Fine. Weight is gonna go right into the heels. We're gonna come up and down, two, one, and then we're gonna go running in place right here. Okay, so just start to jog in place, moving the arms up and down, hold the core in, bring the knees up, bring the feet up. If you don't feel like running, then you're gonna go power knees right here. Just march, there you go, Jody. Move around the room, keep going. We got 10 seconds. We've got seven, six, five, four, three, two, and then we take a break. All right, now we're gonna move into a slow reverse lunge right here. So we're gonna take a step back and then come up. Back and up. Arms come up overhead and then we step together. So we got 15 seconds right here, making sure that our feet are pointed forward. Knee drops 90 degrees, straight back, chest stays up, going. I'm gonna forgot to mute you guys. Keep moving right there. Give me one more on each side. Okay, all right. Now we're gonna go into some hip openers. So we're just gonna take the leg and we're gonna go side to side right here. Good. All right, you've got 10 seconds right here. And then we're gonna move into a toe touch. Three two, and then toe touch right here. So we're gonna start to pick it up just a little bit right here. Nothing too crazy. Reaching across, drawing the abs every time you bring your leg up. Working that core right here, warming up. We're almost ready to go. Keep going. You've got 10 seconds right here. Six, five, four, three, two, and then we're gonna take a break right here. Okay, we're gonna move to the floor. And we're gonna grab, I'm sorry, Jamie, I can't wait Weights, all right. So you're gonna grab your weights. You're gonna have one weight for your first move. You're gonna start off, I'm gonna move this, in a weighted crunch. So you're gonna lay down on your back with one weight. You're gonna take that weight and you're gonna come up and you're gonna just hold that weight right here. Now, if you don't, if you need an extra challenge, you're gonna pick your feet up off the floor. All right, 45 seconds. Ready? And here we go. Okay, so you can either be right here or if it's too much, you're gonna put your feet on the floor and you're gonna go down. You're gonna bring the weight up overhead. Good job, Jane. Reach 
Good job, Jody. Perfect. That is absolutely perfect. Reaching right up. Take that weight and reach right up overhead. Beautiful job. Right up overhead, Jamie. Reach straight up in the air. There you go. You're going to feel it in your upper abs. He's like, hey, I don't like the daisy you can't work out as much. You can see a lot deeper. <laughs> Keep going. Two, one, and then we take a break. All right, 15 seconds. We're going to go ahead and we're going to stand up right here. Our next move is going to be a front kick side kick. So you're going to really get these obliques here. So you're going to come down, you're going to go front kick, and then you're going to go side kick. All right? Here we go. Front and side. All right. So you've got one to the front and then one to the side. One leg. Is that what you said to me, Jane? One weight. One weight and one leg, okay? So we're burning out one side. Good job. And then I'm gonna have you switch in three, two, and then other side right here. Front and side right here. Okay, so you go front and then you go side. Really intentional. Now, if you wanted to add more intensity here, you can hop this one. You can add a little hop on each side. If you want to keep it low impact, then we're lifting and kicking right here. Front and side. Three, two, and then we take a break right here. 15 seconds off. All right, get ready. Cardio, core move, down to the mat. In four, three, mountain climbers. And here we go. So mountain climbers right here. You're gonna run your knees in right here. Mountain climbers right here. All right, stay right there. Keep going. Drawing in the abs. We're running. There you go, running in the knees as fast as you can. Hold the abs in. Keep going. You can run up the mountain. You can walk up the mountain. You can do a couple steps running. Do a couple steps walking. Keep going, keep going, keep going. You've got 15 seconds. Push hard right here. You've got seven, six, five, four, three, two, and then take a break. Ah, right there. Break. All right, 15 seconds. Back up to the top of the circuit, weighted crunch. Grab that weight. You're going to go back down on the floor. Get the weight ready. Two. One, you can go right back to your back and you're gonna go reach up right here. Weighted crunch right here, reaching straight up with that weight. Keep going. There you go. Draw in the abs, reach straight up overhead. There, perfect. Now, if having your weight or your, uh, legs up is too much for you, you're gonna put your legs on the floor and you're just gonna continue to reach up right here. All right, you got 15 seconds. Keep going. Woo, upper abs are burning. They're like, hey, you've done this to me before. And we're responding to them. Yes, for four, three, two, you take a break right there. Okay, all right. We're gonna come up to a standing position and we're gonna go into front kick, side kick. This time, if you wanna hold two weights, we've got this down. You can hold two weights on this one. All right, so we're gonna start off on the left side. You're gonna come down, we're gonna go front kick, and then we're gonna go side kick. Okay, so now if you got two weights in your hand, you're gonna feel that added resistance. And you're working to stay balanced on the other side. Remember, you can jump, not jump, it'd be a hop. I'm gonna call it a hop. So you can hop, or you can just power lift right here. Two, one, and then over to the other side, right here, right side. Okay, burning out the other side now. Front kick, side kick, chest up, eyes up, keeping the chest above. We want to make sure that as we get a little bit breathless here, that the oxygen is flowing. Keep going. All right, you've got five, four, three, two, and then we take a break right here. Okay, down to the ground, back to mountain climbers. All right, this time on your mountain climbers, you're gonna come down and we're gonna go crossing side to side. Ready? And we're gonna go right here, oblique.
weak mountain climbers. Right here. So you're gonna go down and you're gonna move the knees side to side, okay? Side to side, really drawing in the abs. Make sure that you're really paying attention to getting those knees to the side of your body. Perfect. All right, come on, Jane, you got it, you got it, you got it. Pulling those knees. Good. Jody crushing it. Tracy, I know is crushing it, but I can't see her, so I just like, I have this little imaginary Tracy down there, and she's moving her knees side to side. You can run them, or you can walk them. Two, one, and then we take a break. 30 seconds off, all right. Water time, grab your water. All right, next move. You're gonna use light weights. If you can't even, if you can't get through this one with light weights, don't be surprised, it's okay. Drop the weights, do this without the weights. All right, so I might even recommend doing it without the weights to start off with. So I'm gonna demo, it's a bow and arrow crunch. You're gonna come back, you're gonna make a bow, you're gonna draw it in together over to the other side, extend, and then draw it back, okay? So you either do this with or without a weight. Ready? And follow me. All right, so we're gonna lay back right here, and then we're gonna pull the arrow across, and then to the other side. Now, if you're feeling like this isn't challenging enough, lay back or lean back a little harder, or grab those weights. If it's still not hard enough, you're gonna lift up your feet right here, and we're gonna go into an ab hold with a bow and arrow, okay? Keep going, these are tough. These are really, really hard. So you're gonna keep breathing, keep going. Get ready, three, two, one, and then stop right there. Okay, you got 15 seconds to recover. We're gonna come up to a stand. We're gonna hit a cardio move right here. All right, so, ooh, I know, those are burners. So we're gonna get ready. High knee run, two, one, right here. High knee run, get the knees up, arms pumping right here. Run, 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 run. Good job. All right, bring those knees up real strong. Right here, good job, Tracy. All right, keep going. You've got those knees moving, arms are pumping fast as you can. We got 25 seconds right here. Stay nice and strong, keep going. Come on, Jane. There you go. Woo! All right. Heart should be in your throat right now. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Use those arms. Pump, 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 pump. You got 10 seconds. Burn it out right here. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, and then we're going to take a break. Okay. Dolphin jacks. So we're going to come down to the mat. I'm going to demo this one first. So you're going to come up to the mat right here. You're gonna take your feet. You're gonna go up. You're gonna go down. You're gonna go jack, jack, okay? So you're gonna go booty up like a dolphin coming up out of the wire. Go flat and then jack, jack. All right, keep going. Ready? And 45 seconds right here. I'm gonna demo this again down here on the floor. Okay, so you're gonna go up. Right here, dolphin. Flatten out, jack, jack. Dolphin up, go flat, jack, jack. Okay, good job, perfect. Everybody's got it, everybody's looking nice. Okay, really drawing those lower abs. Good, flatten out, perfect, Jamie. Holding that plank, nice and strong, you got 10 seconds. Keep going, five, four, three, two, take a break right here, 15 seconds off. All right, we're ready, back up to the top. Bow and arrow crunch. So we're gonna come to a seated position. We're gonna grab those weights and we're gonna get ready. Now remember, here we go, we're going back. All right, so you can either do this with a weight, or you can do this without a weight. And if you do it with a weight, if you feel like you need more 
challenge. And you're going to pull those feet up right here. Just keep going. We're trying to make it 45 seconds. We can do it. Come on. All right. Oh, that's okay. It's okay. See, he's strong, but he threw the weights. It's okay because you know what? If you throw those weights down right here and you're able to stay in your ab hold for the full 45 seconds, you're killing it. All right, stop right there. Okay, take a breath. All right, 15 seconds off right here. We're gonna stand up. We're gonna go to the high knee run. Up we go. Okay, get ready, set, and back to the high knee run right here. Okay, high knee run. Knees up, knees up, knees up. Pump, 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 pump. All right, we've got 40 seconds. Come on, there we go. I can't stand not being able to run. Literally killed me. So I'm just run, 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 run. Get down low, I'll do this. That's what I'll do, I can do this. Keep going, keep going. Run, run, run. Bring those knees up, pump the fists up and down. There you go. Keep going, you got 15 seconds right here. All right, keep going. You've got 10 seconds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Take a break right there. Okay, 15 seconds off. All right, take a step and then bring you down on the mat. Dolphin jacks. We're going back into the sea. So I'm gonna push that down for a second. We're gonna go up right here. Okay, so push back, dolphin up, flat back, and then two jacks. All right, up, flat, and then jack, jack. Really controlling the core, the lower abs here, okay? I want you to really focus on the movement there. Push back, feel, feel the abs draw all the way up toward the spine when you push back. Keep going, we got 20 seconds. Keep going. You guys are doing so good. We're ready to start another circuit. In just a second. Six, five, four, three, two, and then take a break right there. 30 seconds off. All right. You've got 30 seconds. You're gonna breathe. And we're gonna stay down on the ground for your next move. All right. So I'm gonna demo this one right here. So you're gonna come up into a plate. You're gonna be nice and strong. You're gonna take the weight. You're gonna drag it through, and then you're gonna drag it to the other side right here, okay? So now, you gotta think about it. You gotta squeeze your abs and really keep that squeeze. Here we go. Do it with me right here. So you're gonna bring it all the way through. You're gonna try really, really hard to keep your back flat. You're gonna try hard to keep the booty down, and you're also gonna try hard to keep those hips nice and still. All right, keep going. All right, you doing okay with that one, James? Yeah. Reach it all the way through, but Jamie, be careful because I want your back to stay very straight. Okay, keep going. Jody, in case you didn't see the demo on that one, here it is. So you're going through, and then through. And what I'm telling the crew, keep the hips nice and straight. So we don't wanna move our hips side to side. We really wanna use our core to stabilize. Perfect, absolutely perfect. Four, five, four, three, two, and then you take a break. Okay, all right. Now, next move. Okay, cardio core right here. You're gonna come into a plank jack. So you're gonna come up into a plank and you're gonna go into a jack right here. Ready? And here we go. All right, so plank jack right here. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Okay, moving the feet in and out. Now, if that's too much for you, I just want you to come into a plank and I just want you to step it out right here. But if you can continue that plank jack, you're gonna sweat. It's like one of the best things you can do for cardio core. Keep going. You can even do four jacks and then you can do four step outs. No shame right there. Just take it easy, just get through it. For seven, six, fight it, fight it. Four, three, two, and 
then take a break. Ah, uh, right there. Okay. Next move. Okay. Next move, next move. Slowly come up to a stand. This one is without a weight, okay? So we're gonna touch down in the front right here. We're gonna come up and we're gonna kick. So we're gonna touch down and we're gonna stand up and kick, all right? Ready? One side only. I'm gonna start on my left side. All right, so right leg goes back and forward. Right leg back and forward. Doesn't matter which side. Just keep your chest up, okay? When you come down toward the ground, I want your eyes to stay up. We're gonna burn out the legs here. Good job. This is cardio core, this is lower abs, but it's a lot of lower body right here. Two, one, now we're gonna go to the other side. Down and up. Now you can keep this lower impact if you just work on it as a balance move right here. If you want it to be cardio, you're coming down and then jump kicking up. Keep going. Good job. One move using the core, nice strong punch. We come up, bring the F's in our mouth. Nice strong punch, good job. Three, two, one. We take a break right here, 15 seconds off. Back to the top of that circuit, are you ready? All right, come down. Okay, plank drag. So you're gonna come down. Three, two, one. Now remember on the plank jag, if I didn't mention it before, if this is too much for you in a full plank, drop to your knees. Reach it all the way through and over, and then go to the other side. It's a great way to get through this exercise. If you're not used to holding a full plank, go down to your knees for this one. Keep going. Hips are gonna stay nice and straight. Good job. Yep. Good job, Jane. All right, reach it through. Nice flat back, booty stays down. Keep breathing. Don't forget to breathe. For four, three, two, and then we take a break right there. 15 seconds off. Okay. All right. We're gonna stand up. Instead of doing mountain climbers on this one, we're gonna do jacks where we touch the toe right here, okay? We're just gonna reach across. One, and here we go. All right, so we're gonna go across the body right here. Now, you can stay right here. This is about our mid-level. One level down, we're just touching the toe. If you wanna go nutty, get the leg all the way up and really give it a good jump right here. Just make the movement a little bit bigger. Okay, you've got 20 seconds. Keep going. Reaching all the way across, twisting. Got a controlled twist. Just a rotation right here. We're not looking to twist you in half, just to the outside of the foot right here. Three, two, one. We take a break. Okay. Woo! Sip of water. We got another cardio right here. All right, so we're gonna start out left shoot, left leg back, right arm down, and then we're gonna come up and kick. Okay, here we go. So going down and then up and kick. Back to this one. All right. I have to give our booties something here. Throw the booty the bone. Right down. Okay. So you're working your quads here. You're working your hammies. Keep going, but we're still working that core. Keep going down, reach down toward the ground. Get ready, we're gonna switch it over to the other side. Right here, right leg goes back and then up. We're either packing it or we're just lifting. Down, you're gonna feel your balance really challenged here. We're reaching down, chest comes up. Good job, Jody. All right. I see it, Tracy. That's looking great. Going down. 90 degree drop down. Good. Two, one. Take a break. 30 seconds off. Okay. Next. Move. I'm going to bring us down to the ground. You can grab some water right here. All right. Renegade twist with a dumbbell. So that, that's going to look like you're going to come up. You're going to 
You're gonna be in a plank. You can do this on your knees too. So you're gonna bring it up. You're gonna open to the side right here. And we're gonna work the whole side. Two, one, and here we go. This is only one side. So pick one side right here. And we're gonna burn out one side. Turn and twist. Good. All right, we're gonna try to get it. All the way out to the side. You can see him, he's bringing that weight right into his chest and then reaching straight up. Excellent job. You should be feeling that straight through the front core all the way onto the oblique. All right, right over to the other side. Switch it over. Keep going. 30 seconds each side. That's what we're looking for. Good job. Jody reaching. Tracy, I can see your weight shooting up in the air. It looks perfect. Good job. I love it. For six, five, hold the abs. Three, two, one. We take a break. Okay. We're ready to stand up. Cardio. Cardio on deck. Knee tap run. All right. This is going to take high knees to a new level. So we're going to start doing our high knees, but then we're going to add our tap. Okay. So here we go. All right. Bring the knees up. Then we're going to tap right here. Keep going. Good job. Elbow to the knee. He's not running. He's not leaving the ground, but he's real intentional. He's coming down. Elbow to the knee right here. We're getting in that rotation. We're working the core. Keep going. Oh, I can do this one. I'm not shaking around my head. Keep going. Elbow to knee right here. If you're running, get those knees up. Good job, Jody. Twisting, going across. Gargling our heart. I know because we're almost there. And we take a break right there. 15 seconds up. All right. Woo. Take a breath for a second before we go down to the ground. We're going to work those booties right here. So we're going to do booty bridge with a weight. So we're going to come down to the ground. We're going to go onto our back. And we're going to start to lower and lift right here. We're going to put the weight on the hips and we're going to start lowering and lifting ready and here we go okay so you're coming down and you're going to start lowering and lifting now a couple safety notes not safety notes this is going four notes we're not going to let the booty touch the ground we're going to hover just above the ground and then we're going to come up and squeeze right here okay Keep going, nice and slow and steady, focusing on that good core. Keep going, give me another 15 seconds here, and then I'm going to tell you to hold it up at the top, and you're going to squeeze, you're going to squeeze like you're holding a pencil, and we're just going to pulse. All right, four, three, two, now stay up, flatten up, and squeeze, and just hold, and now you can start to pulse, pulse. I'm gonna get on my back and demo that one right here. We're gonna pulse right there. I know, Jamie Carvel. And we're gonna take a break, okay. All right, 15 seconds off, okay. Now we're gonna go back into our renegade twist, okay? So we're gonna come back onto our knees. Two, one, and we're gonna come up and we're gonna open. We're back to knees. Over and open. Okay, you're on one side. Nice and strong. There you go. Good job, Jim. Okay, beautiful job, Jody. Getting that full rotation. I love it. Being careful with the shoulder. Always good. Two, one. We're going to go over to the other side, and you're going to start opening to the other side. So you're going to come up and open up and open okay Jody you're doing something that I often will suggest to people if the full extension is too much for you you're gonna keep your arm bent and you're just gonna go into a bent arm right here which is absolutely perfect you're still up oh, no, she's extending again you got back you got your spiky strength back and we're gonna take a break right there 15 
15 seconds off. All right, move the weights out of the way. Standing up, knee tap run. Okay, so we're gonna come off two, one, and we're gonna go back to knee tap run right here. So we're tapping the knees, elbow to knee, right here. If you can't get your elbow to your knee, then you're gonna tap, tap, and you're running, 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 right here, getting the knees up. And you got 30 seconds, pace yourself right there. Keep going, breathing. Come on, we got this. Good job. I'm jogging, I'm doing my knees right here. Elbow to the knees right here, keep going. You got 15 seconds, guys, fight through it right here. Twisting through, tapping the knee. Wherever we're doing, we're getting in that rotation right here. Three, two, one, and then we take a break. Okay, Woo, recover, come down to the ground. We got another set of booty bridges. Okay, I promised you, I promised you this wasn't about the abs only. We don't leave our friend the cheeks out of the party. So put the weights right on the hips and we're gonna come up. Now, this time, instead of the pulse up at the top, when I see go at the 15 second mark, you're gonna hold the weights and you're gonna move your feet, your knees out to the side, but not yet, okay? Just wait, it's coming. You got about 20 seconds right here. Lower and lift, nice and easy. You got about seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay, now you're gonna come up and you're gonna move it out, okay? So now we're pushing the knees apart. So now we're working the outside of the booty, but we still got those weights loaded up on those hips. Burning, burning, burning. I know, I know, it's so good. Two, one, and then we take a break right there. 30 seconds off, okay. Now we just got some toning in order. So drop the weights, grab a sip of water, and stay on the ground. We've got a set of abs. Straight up normal core. No cardio involved. Okay. So be proud of yourself. Take a break right here. We're going to start off in our frog crunch right here. So you're going to go elbows to knees, heels together, and we're going to extend right here. Okay. In and out. Right here, focusing on that burn. We're gonna go in and out, in and out. Keep going. Squeezing those abs, bringing the elbows toward the knees. Heels are together, we move out. Two, one, take a break. Okay, we're gonna go into a bicycle crunch in four, three, two, here we go. Bicycle crunch, okay. All right, so we're gonna start off right here. We're gonna go side to side, point the toe, go across. Now, when we hit the, the 15 second mark, I want you to stop on whatever side that is and I just want you to pulse. Okay, so 10 seconds, keep going right here and then get ready. We're going to switch it over right now. So stop on whatever side and you're gonna pulse, pulse, pulse. Keep going, right there, keep going. I know, it's burning, stay right there. All right, ready? And switch it right over to the other side, pulse into the other side. This is a heck of a, heck of a combo. We're gonna keep breathing right there. Five, four, three, two, and then take a break, release, down, 10 seconds off. Okay, Russian twist, we're gonna grab that weight right here. Three, two, one, and you're gonna lean back right here. Now, we're gonna, don't feel like you need to get your legs off the ground. We did that bow and arrow crunch during our, during our routine, so if you're feeling like you don't wanna lift the legs up off this one, don't worry about it. Just do the crunch without the leg lift. Just get that rotation in right here. Okay, five, four, three, two, 
one. We're on our second to last move. We're gonna put our feet down right here and we're gonna go reach ups right here. Okay, so you're gonna have your feet up and you're gonna start reaching toward the toe right here. Reaching up, this is a mini ab series. We're just doing some basic toning. I've already worked your abs. You are set for abs and cardio for the day. I've even gotten, even a, honestly, quite a bit of booty work in there, so. You guys should feel really proud of yourselves. And rest right here, we're officially cooled down. So just take a couple deep breaths on the floor while I switch you over to your cool down music. Okay, all right. So we're gonna start off, we're on our back. We're gonna start off on our back. So let's work on the glutes first. One leg comes up, figure four stretch, pull straight back right here. And you're just gonna gently rock side to side, massaging the lower back right here. And then you're gonna go over to the other side and just rock, pulling back gently, feeling your glute and your hamstring really release here, stretching. Okay, lower back release. So you're gonna put your arms out to the side. You're gonna put your knees over to one side and you're gonna turn your head opposite and feel the lower back release right here. And then over to the other side. You guys can always do these more during my stretch video that I'm gonna record for you. Um, I'm gonna try later today. You're gonna see a lot of these stretches and they're gonna be longer. Now you're gonna flip over to your stomach. Anything that works, you can repeat later. Cobra up right here. And then you're gonna lower down. And then you're gonna move the hands out. And then you're gonna come up. And then you're gonna come down. All right, now I want you to just come onto your knee. And I just want a reach under right here should feel really good on your back. When we work our abs, we have to make sure that we really make sure that we take care of our stretching of our back. Good. Because a lot of times we get a lot of tension from holding those positions on their side. Good job. Stay down there. Keep going. And then you're gonna go into a down dog. So you're gonna come up. You're gonna press right back, right here, right, right here. Press all the way back, head down. Press all the way back. You're gonna lift the right leg, bring it through. Right here. You can forward fold down. And then you're gonna push back up into that down dog. Push back. Lift left, bring left through. There you go. Forward fold down. You can extend the arms out. Get a good stretch right here. All right, now we're gonna try to get ourselves up to our standing, but not all the way up. So you're gonna come forward, feet come forward, grab the elbows, and just hang right here. We're gonna go lower back release, pull back release, really. And we're just gonna go neutral and we're just gonna go side to side. Let the head hang. All right, now I just want you to start to slow roll up. Head is the last thing to come up. And once you're all the way up, you're gonna bring the arms up overhead, grab the wrist, take a step out to the left and then reach to the right. A little bit of balance, help with balance so we can get a bigger stretch. And then take a step to the right, and then nice reach over on the other side. We're gonna stretch out our back right here. You're gonna take your arms, you're gonna clasp them in front. You're gonna push forward, push away. Bring them in, and then push it away again. Good job. Clasp the arms in the back. Look up, reach up and just hold here, just for a minute. 
And then all I need is two deep breaths. Deep breath in and release. Deep breath in and release. You guys have made it. 659. Woo! That was good timing. All right, let me just hit stop.